Hello everybody, my name is Ivica, thank you all so very much for joining me on my latest Roblox beginner tutorial video that will show you how you can weld or connect elements together, different parts that then you can blend into a singular element with different shapes and sizes. Now to do that we're first of all going to add few parts, here is my base kind of element that is a block, I'm going to add it and then I'm going to add two wedges here and another wedge here and I'm going to add these to the baseline block. Now how do I do that? Well first of all I need to activate this option here under your home tab which is join surfaces, make parts together, make parts join together at touching surfaces. Once you have that selected you'll see that you have kind of a different looking part here as you can see the white outline shows where the connection will be created and i'm going to move this slightly here now i'm going to add the second element but i'm going to rotate it so it's facing the other way around and it's here and then i'm going to again move remember joint surface is still active and here we are we have this element that is joined together through the wedge or welded together through the joint surfaces and now I'm going to deselect it and I'm going to add these two parts to the first part here by selecting them and drag and dropping them. Now when I select it I have a unified new model, a new static mesh let's call it like that, that I can then scale up that I can change in different manners, I can rotate as a singular unit and basically can add further elements to it or do whatever I like while I have it in the explorer as just the part. That's it, pretty simple, pretty easy, pretty effective, hopefully you found this tutorial informative, hopefully you helped it with the issue that you faced and now you know how to weld parts together in Roblox. Thank you so much for watching, if you'd like to support me please check out my Patreon page, please check out my channel memberships, I do a lot of tutorials in user generated content domain, so that's Roblox and Fortnite Creative for now, and of course the cheapest, easiest, fastest way to support me is just to subscribe to my channel and be here for my new tutorials. My name is Ivica, thank you so much for watching, have a great day and I'll talk to you when I do another tutorial, until then. Have a great day and have loads of fun in your Roblox projects. Bye bye.